Good morning, my little rays of sunshine. How are you guys doing this fine morning? Let me put on my seatbelt here. Hang on. It's January 29th, 2021. 6.30 in the morning. After this video, I'm definitely taking a nap. I am on my butt right now, but I'm just so excited about this weather, I can't even tell you. So, yes, yes, yes. So we're gonna go through the ski resorts real quick and then, uh, oh look at that, we got stuck on the little, we're good though. I just need to go fast through it. Just we have traffic, that's the third. I don't want to run into traffic here. We got this. I just need to come from farther back. All right guys, unfortunately we have to blast through it, but that's okay. Hope no cars coming. Probably woke up my neighbors with that loud something but isn't that cool how just easy i mean and you know what check out what what else i did i completely cleaned off the car so we have the perfect view of this morning and the windshield last night i spent 30 minutes right before it started snowing cleaning the hell out of it with like like uh some, some, like some sort of a dish sponge with like a really rugged back side of it and just getting everything off the inside and the outside i spent 30 minutes i really did this is all the trash from it from everything yeah it's crazy so but anyway hang on a sec all right sorry about that anyway we're in moon ridge right now we're gonna go to the we're, we're gonna go to bear mountain but we're gonna go in the other way and look up here you see a little bit of trying to clear but that's gonna be engulfed any moment we're not gonna do the whole lake right now even though that would be gorgeous man wouldn't that be gorgeous That'd be gorgeous. You guys are worth it, I'll tell you that. I'm just so tired. I promise you, not tired enough to where I, I'm a danger to other people on the road. I won't do that to other people, I promise. Oh yeah. See, so yeah, I'm still getting some snow. As you can see up here, a little clearing up, and then look over there, the dark clouds over Bear Mountain. Look at that. Boom. Woo! That's where we're going, folks. This is the golf course. Anybody want to go golfing? They do have snow, like, uh, it's like, uh, uh, I don't know. Oh, no, they have glow golf. But surprisingly, I had, well, I guess I had heard of it years ago back when golf was all I was doing. But, uh, yeah, at nighttime, some nights they'll have, uh, like, uh, just come out here and play glow in the dark golf. It's, it's really cool.
charging down. Jeez, look, he's hauling some serious butt. That's got to be so much fun. Look at him. Where'd he go? Oh, he's gone already. And he was hauling. Getting, getting ready for the day. You know what? These people behind us are definitely going to the parking lot where we're going to right now, so I'm going to have to get up ahead of them a little bit. So I can make a U-turn and pretend like I'm a tourist and don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I didn't know I can't go up here. Works every time. Works like a charm. Someday that's all going to come to an end though. Because I'll be recognized all the time. <laughs> that's going to be years from now. But in this little town with 5,000 full-time residents, I mean, come on, right? Look at this. This is... None of these guys left last night. But anyway, let's just take a clear. You know what? So, yeah, we're going to have to make a YouTuber back out. And we'll, we'll wait for this guy to uh, sweet. All right, hang on. So we're gonna go down here. Look at that. Look at that. Bear Mountain looks insane. You guys are gonna have so much fun today. I'm telling you guys. Place, man. It's a beautiful place. <clears throat> what a winter wonderland. Sorry we couldn't stay up there long. The guy was going to pull a power trip, so I thought instead of getting into it with him, we would leave. Try to avoid that type of confrontation early in the morning. But actually, this is really late at night for me. <laughs> Look at that, man. Oh, man, it's so beautiful. I wish I still worked there. It's just a beautiful place. I wish I still worked there, man. It's all right. So this is like the perfect time. This is right before everyone's getting ready to start going out to the ski resorts. So we're getting on the road right at the perfect time to get this through without a bunch of traffic. Look at this, look at Goldmine. This is the main street for Bear. Nothing, nobody, no, you know what? I bet people are having a hard time getting up here. I'll bet that's what it is, no joke. I'll bet that's what it is. Look at these piles, look at these huge piles of snow. because I have a lot of nostalgia here. shop the pro shop <laughs> oh where's my head at <laughs> if you guys saw the last video what is going on oh look at, look at my witcher wiper i freaking there's something going on with it i, I need to fix it 
you guys see that? Look. Bloop, 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 bloop. Bloop, 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 bloop. Okay, so we need to find us. Uh, I'm gonna pull into my friend's neighborhood here real quick so I can fix that. Bear with me a second. See, even though there's no one on the road right here, someone might be coming up on me fast, expecting no one on the road still, and then they may uh, run into me accidentally, trying to hit the brakes. So look, we have a perfect place to stop. Check it out. That sound is really annoying. Well, looks like I'm gonna have to get some new windshield wipers. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna have to uh, get some new windshield wipers, but I'm fine with that. I wanna get like the most badass ones out there that are really good for winter because I'm tired of going through these damn things all the time. If I can spend 10, 15 bucks more and just get one pair instead of three pairs for the winter time, then we're freaking good. But this is always happening. I thought this time we would get away with it. I didn't think it was a big deal. I mean, it's still working, but not super impressively. Guys, I am so happy to have you guys here with me. This is this is club view, okay? Oh, 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 we're getting dumped on. The power wires took a dump. It took a stump, a stump. It took a stump. Oh, just beautiful. There's Baldwin out there. Look, guys, look. It's the, the Big Bear snow rule. Look it out there. I guarantee you. When we drive out there for our drive later for the aftermath, because the aftermath is going to be probably this afternoon, and then tomorrow, or maybe even this afternoon, I'll do a drone flight. But the the thing is, is that I cannot do it. Um, it says that it can go down to like 23, 23 degrees for the drone flight. However, I don't. I. Th it says you shouldn't take it down below 32 anyway. Across the street here is one of the satellite parking lots. This is where um, is a good place to learn how to kind of, you know, lose control, gain control, stuff like that. I think we'll, we might, uh, we've done too many donuts already, but we'll be able to loose right here, maybe, no. Wow, look at all, look at all the snow. I don't think we got that much snow though, you guys. I know we still have a couple more hours left of snow. We got about three, four, or five more hours. But it's it, it's it, it's nothing crazy. It's just just like I told you guys, man. I've been right a lot. I've been right a lot. I don't, and I know it's like okay. The thing is, is that every like weather person out there, and I'm not one of them, but every one of them, every meteorologist, and the people who report the weather. They all get the same information from the same sources, from like the National Weather Service, the US radar, and then the European. But yeah, anyway, we're gonna take the main roads this time, the whole time, so you guys get a sense of what it's like right now, even though this is probably not doing it any real justice of what it's gonna be like. God, I could use a mocha frappuccino right now, I'll tell you that. I don't want to waste any time getting this thing uploaded. Stupid windshield wiper. If you guys know of a, a place that sells like a iPhone holders to like, a, that's like extra strong though for the car so you can record while you're driving. Um, because all the I've, all the phone holders that I've purchased, like even the ones that I've spent like 30, 40, 50 bucks for, just for a simple iPhone holder for the car, um, just it just shakes and bobbles too much. It's just not good. So I was hoping maybe you guys new of a company or something that I could look into so I can get something better. 
Because I guarantee you we'll even have more fun if I have two hands on the wheel the whole time instead of one. Just since tonight we had a full tank. Look at that. Look at that. That's awesome. because it keeps you guys safe and trust me like I can empathize because my my aunt used to, was and still is so scared of the mountain roads and stuff like that and so trust me like like she gets into serious panic mode like serious guys like panic attack city so it, it it's a real serious thing and I do take it seriously I don't want any of you getting sick or or just not not having a not having a, a good time of it you know I just would not would not be fun. So, yeah, look at that. We got the snow plizzy in the hizzy. Oh, he's backing up now, is he? Wow, I'm a poet and didn't know it. <laughs> See, even he's sliding. He went right through the light. He had to back up now. What a, what a backer upper. spots saw about 10 inches earlier so they're, they're probably just just over a foot right now but like my house probably saw seven eight inches already so not quite what was expected but it's still great we could use it we need it it's still beautiful and it makes it look like it's a lot more because we already had all that other snow so it just really makes it look like a huge dump I like Blower's board shop. It's a good one. Let's put you guys outside for a minute. See, see how you guys feel. Technology would be awesome once you can like feel that. That'll be so cool. So what we're doing is we're gonna go around here. That's the post office that I go to all the time. You know, you know. There's a lake and you can see the other side a little bit over there. Wow, this is so pretty. Go through the 
village here in just a second. Wow. And you guys are just going to have such a great time when you guys come up here. Just a great time, man. Seriously, I love the way the hotel that I stayed at looks. Look at all the cars completely covered. Completely covered. It's full too, I'm so happy. I'm so happy you guys are up here, man. This is great. You guys are up here, having a good time. This place looks a little quiet, but we're gonna stay there too. I promise, we're gonna stay there too. We're gonna stay at so many of these places for you guys. Foster again. Get my windshield wipers going a little bit on the fast side going. There's a new, the new station again. Man, we saw them during the live. I've been on the news up here one time. I recorded it for us. Once I saw it on the news, on TV, I recorded it and I made a video for us. But this was back when I had like, this was after like my, or, or during my third year doing this. I probably had like three three or 400 subscribers. Not, not that many, maybe a little bit less than that. It's really weird, just in the past two years, it's really picked up. Anyway, we were gonna take this back street, but I told you guys we were gonna take the main roads. So this is leaving the village. You know what, we were gonna go down the village, weren't we? So we're gonna flip it right here, hang on. Just force of habit, guys. When I'm driving by myself without recording, I just go right through because it saves a lot of time. Usually the village is packed. What are they building here? Is that weird? Have, have I have, have we not noticed this? Have I not noticed this? It's gonna be called Chirp. Oh, look it, look it, look it, look it. We got some blue trying to peek through, but it's not happening because that darkness is coming right through. Village, folks. And we're definitely going to be staying here. This is one of my favorite places. This is where I used to stay like a couple years before I, I, I moved up here. Every time I'd come up here, I'd stay at the Robin Hood Resort. We're going to do that again. snowplow guy just went right through the light. That's not good. Hope everyone's okay. There's the amber lamps. You got some blown snow here. Look at this. I'm driving into like a blizzard up here. Look at that. That's the problem with tire chains, but for you guys that are uncomfortable, I so recommend it. Even if they say don't, you don't have to have it, which I'm sure they do right now, but even if they say you don't, if you're uncomfortable, please don't take the risk. Like it's it's not like when you're a kid wearing a freaking a bicycle, a bicycle helmet, like you're gonna look like an idiot. It's not like that, trust me. 
you're gonna be safe. Everyone else has them on too. Um, I should probably have them. I'm just, I'm just not that smart about it, I guess. I'm a lot more experienced, um, and we'll pay the consequences. But look, it's dumping up there. Look at that. It's really coming down up here. So we're gonna see if we can get into snow summit through the back route. Look at that, we just slam on the brakes, no problem. Make the turn, no problem. Unbelievable. That's a testament to how good they're, they plow the road. So I want you guys to see that. Once again though, I'm not trying to say I'm a good driver. I just make it look, I feel a little bit easier than it is. Um, so don't don't get overconfident by watching me and saying, oh, that's simple, That that looks like nothing. Because even a simple little hill like this, you have to have your foot on the gas just right, you guys. Like, like uh, it's, you'll learn, you'll learn. And you won't learn the hard way, but when you make it up here, late at night, go into those empty parking lots like I do and practice doing donuts and stuff. I'm telling you, it'll help you so much. You will be very surprised. And for those of you who are saying, I'm not a child, I'm not gonna do that. Don't look at it like that. Look at it like you're, you're doing whatever you can to boost your safety and that's a good thing oh yeah we made it we made it before anybody the birds got here well, we got some blue skies above above snow summit what's up big fat bird These guys, man. That's a great place, huh? Look at that backyard. That patio just faces the mountain. How awesome is that? These guys are like, dude, this guy's an idiot. Why is he going the wrong way? Sorry guys. Sorry, 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 take evergreen though because we were going to take brownie anyway so let's just take evergreen look at you can barely see the entrance to the road but this road is so pretty guys this is probably one of the prettiest roads we'll take all day today the next road i'm taking is the bed road Decent amount of snow. See, closer here to the ski resorts, they definitely did get about a foot, at least a foot more. Maybe a little bit more. It's because we're at the, right at the bottom, basically. There's one more street up, Switzerland, which is literally right at the bottom. I really don't like seeing blue skies, though. Not when we have these supposedly huge snows, snowstorms. This was big, this was big. I just think I'm just spoiled lately. We've just been really spoiled. I mean, look at all that snow though, I mean, come on. It's crazy amounts. I guess that is a little bit more than, than a foot. My house is right across the street over here. How cool is that? I live right across the street from these mansions and I live in a little shanty. But that's okay, I love it.
guarantee you these are some fighters right now jogging. High altitude training. We get that a lot up here. There's a lot of fight gyms up here. I used to work out at Bear City Jiu Jitsu. But then shortly after COVID hit pretty hard. Wow, guys. I want to rent this place for all of us, though. That'd be awesome. And then I can't wait to see what Apple's bed and breakfast looks like straight ahead right here. Right on. Look at how look at how adorable that place is, you guys. Are you kidding me? Just amazing. Wow, look at that guy hauling. You think I drive fast? That guy's hauling, man. He is amazing. So behind us, it's dumping up there. You can't see that. Anyway, I love you guys. Hope you guys have a good day. I'm gonna take a little bit of a nap now. I love you all. And thank you for everything. Thank you for everything you do for me. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Thank you. I love you all. Peace out. I'll talk to you guys later. Wait, let's 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 bust through one of these. Uh... Oh man. Oh man. Here we go. Yeah. All right. I love you guys.